to my channel this is Arshana here I'm back with a new video and today I want to introduce y'all to my new wig if you got me on social media then you already know what color it is and if you saw the thumbnail of course you know how it looks but I cannot do my makeup with you know hair all in my face so I'm gonna just put it on at the end of the video but for right now what we're gonna I'm gonna basically do a makeup look that I can wear with my red wig because for the simple fact is you can't just do any makeup look with that color wig I feel like that's just me so I'm gonna do something very neutral but glam at the same time so I'm gonna go in with the Morphe 3502 Morphe 3502 palette and I'm gonna just basically I never did this style off camera so you guys, you guys are the first to see so this if you have not seen this palette this palette basically has a lot of cool tones browns oranges um lots of nice shimmers gold shimmers etc um my favorite color here fire um yeah so we're gonna just do a nice glam makeup look with this palette I think I'm going to put spice in my crease. Spice is this shade right here. Is that Yeah, spice is right here. I'm going to put spice in my crease. I'm going to go in with rich. This is rich. <laughs> I'm gonna go with the rich right here. Okay guys, now since I you know went back with the brown and the spice color, I'm gonna just basically cut my crease. I don't have to, but I I prefer to because it gives me more precise cut. Like it just looks more clean. That's just my personal preference. Morphe 3502 palette and didn't have this type of pink. I don't know why I didn't think of the Jaclyn Hill palette first. Um, because I wanted something to brighten up my eyes but actually be neutral at the same time. So I basically put away the 3502 palette and I took up my Jaclyn Hill palettes and I just basically went in with I don't have the name city shades, sorry. I just basically put um mixed these two together and to you know deepen up my crease. I just used this chocolate shade here. And so we are done with the eyes. We, I'm going to basically go in with my Fenty Beauty primer. I love us so much. <laughs> Because we don't need these pores. Saying hi to everybody. We don't, we don't want that. We don't we not want that. We don't want that. Okay, guys. I'm gonna go in with the Maybelline, which I haven't used in a while. It's been a long time. I also have a review on this foundation as well. I'm gonna link that down below. Um the Maybelline 
Super Stay Foundation. This is the Maybelline Super Stay Foundation in the shade 356 Warm Coconuts. Bling, bling, uh, uh. Power Glow Highlighter in Rose Gold and the Master Chrome. If you saw my Instagram photos from the day before yesterday, which was Wednesday, um, the highlight was beaming like crazy. So these have been my two go-tos lately. Like this been my go-to, but this with this, I just don't know. Bing, uh, uh, bing, bing. at oh like I got like 15 of these in the house I, mean, I probably over exaggerated but I have a bunch cuz I'll be, I be racking up every time I go to elf I get one do my bottom lash line and pop my wig on so I'll be back. okay guys you made it to the end of this video i thank you so much for watching this video um this is my new baby my new wig i didn't even think i could pull up this color but you know what i was like you know what i could do what i want <laughs> but yeah i love this color um my best friend really did her thing with this wig once again she never fails me once again, she did her th thing with this wig, and I'm also proud of myself because I had to match the color to the hair. When I brought the hair, I had to really do a good match with the color because this was this is a 613 lace closure, and she had to, of course, color it so it can match all the hair. And as you can see, this fits perfectly. You can't even see where the closure stops at. It's just so bomb, and I'm so proud of myself. But to the thanks of her... I kind of know what I'm doing, just just a little bit. So, um, I will link all my best friend information down below. And I have other, I'm starting a little wig series where you just meet my new wig, volume one and two. I will definitely link that down below as well and put it up in the cards. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to click that notification button. So you can get notified every time I upload because we be having fun on this channel. We do the makeup, we do the hair, we do the DIYs, etc. So, if you want to see any other makeup tutorials, let me know. Any other DIYs, any other routines, just let me know. Comment in the description. In the description box. Comment in the comment section. I love you guys so much. And don't forget to follow on my social media so, she, so you can know what's going to happen before it happens. And we're going to just get into some slow-mos real quick. And I'll see y'all guys in the next video.